it truly takes a village and that village can be, you know, several organizations coming together as well as several community members coming together. Since 2019, Safe Summer has served as a space for kids and teens to enjoy free activities and events in Indianapolis. The program is one of the city's solutions to crime. And in its fourth year, our Nikki Dementri shares Safe Summer is expanding in an effort to reach more of the city's youth. This summer, every young person in Indianapolis has a place to go to have fun day or night. In a matter of days, Safe Summer kicks off in the city of Indianapolis. Summer of 2022 marks the program's fourth year. It's about connection, it's about mentorship, and it's about rapport. On Friday nights starting this week and running through August 5th, teens ages 13 to 18 can join in on photography, videography, boxing, and art activities. Learn Share Grow Project is one of the organizations participating. Having a safe place to go to, somewhere that's positive, somewhere that has strong leadership and is building leadership with amongst you, that's super, super important. Learn, Share, Grow focuses on education, art expression, and character development. During Safe Summer, the organization will host art activities, including cookies and canvas. And teach them, I am feeling this way, why am I feeling this way, and how can I put that down on a canvas? How can I put that down on a paper? On Friday nights throughout the summer, events happen here at Riverside, also at Garfield and Washington Parks. But for the first time since Safe Summer started, they're adding programming on Saturday here at Brookside Park. Coming out of the pandemic, um, is it was really critical to provide this additional night to allow kids to have another space to come to. Sports of all sorts will headline Saturday night programming. It's geared towards teaching kids and teens less traditional sports like lacrosse, track and field, and snorkeling. If we can get these young people more resources, then the likelihood of them being involved in violent activities and crimes will re be reduced. Allison Fisher is the founder and CEO of C-Scope Incorporated. The nonprofit provides minority at-risk youth opportunities like snorkeling and scuba diving through introducing them to ocean conservation efforts. You know, I feel like God implanted this vision. I'm just going to do all that I can to touch every child and every young person that I can in the city of Indianapolis. Sports of all sorts is open to kids and teens ages 9 to 17. Saturday events begin June 11th and run through July 30th. Working for you, Nikki Dementry, WRTV.